Yeah, real quick, go. real quick, before I forget. All right, so look, we're going to the junkyard one day, me and my boys, all right? And all the f-ing junkyards uh, in El Paso, like most of them are owned by by Middle Eastern people, right? Like by Muslims. And we go, and this one was owned by Greeks. And they kind of, they still, they, they sounded the same to me because they had an accent, right? And I usually would always tell the, the, the workers, um, Shalom Aleikum, you know, and hoping, hoping, oh, wow. them. and I told it to the f-ing Greek dude, I was like, okay, Shalom Aleikum. And he's like, what? I, I'm not a, f- I'm not a f-ing Muslim. I'm Greek. I don't, I don't, and he's like, all oh, pissed about it. I'm like, oh, fuck. And like, my buddy was like laughing his ass off. And, <laughs> and it was just really funny because the guy got pissed. And I was like, How dare we, you. we left and I was like, damn it. I should have told him that I was Muslim. And I he, was was being, about to say, he was being rude to me. <laughs> flip it on him. Yeah. You got to flip the racism. What do you think about an, a dirt tech swap <laughs> SVT focus? Oh, that's the motor out of the Contour SVT, right? I think so. Yeah. It's the 2.5 liter V6. That thing's got to move. Yeah, for Wait. real. Yeah, I know. I think that's a pretty. What's with all those sponsor stickers on the side? Probably a photoshopped. Probably a bitch to work on. Yeah, I was gonna say they. I think this is photoshopped. You got <laughs> drops the subframe for everything. I was gonna say they fucking shoehorned that thing in there. Not without a doubt, that yeah. is a bitch to work on. Hundred percent. But other than that, pretty pretty cool project. I have to yeah, say. Yeah, like as long as that thing's running, it's great. When it's not running, it's like a three week repair because Netgear's right. You're probably dropping the subframe to do pray to, anything. Pray to God, the only thing you change on that thing is like that little intake boot every time. That's all. That's all you got to change. Let me tell you what troubles it has at the moment. Check engine light is on from the modified Rip. housing for the SVT fuel pump to work. It's an EVAP code that doesn't affect anything. Transmission okay. light is on as the cluster was from an automatic Cougar and the car is manual. Okay. Very small patch of rust on either side of the rear hatch strip and around front driver's wheel behind skirt. Yeah, Chassis like is I'm clean, fine. though, with no major rust on the underside. Dent on the side fender. Bumper has seen better days. After taking a hit from a porcupine. <laughs> okay. Heated That's seat okay. button is tricky to turn on and off and requires some finesse, and it requires 91 octane. So it's two. <laughs> yeah, all right. Eh. Hold on, babe. Let me get the seat heater. You can't handle this. <laughs> <laughs> Let yeah, me turn it off. Right. What are these seats out of? Now. Are these, like, out of a Focus RS? They look like they look. Yeah, they look like they look like, they look like you were Focus ST or or yeah. Yeah, this is Although a cool project. I like this thing for a million miles. So he's Ooh. being pretty upfront with you about all the problems with it. I mean, and they're not like, terrible not problems. Much. That's no. not terrible. I don't think that's a terrible price for this either. To be honest with you, that's that's a that'd be a good car for Florida all day. Yeah. Also, this is sixty five hundred Canadian money. Oh, yeah. it's like five grand. <laughs> it's like how much an late. SVT focus costs here. I'm I'm doing it now. I got it. It's fifty one hundred seventy seven dollars and yeah, eighty okay. cents. So that's not terrible, dude. Like yeah, it's not. Grand for that. He'd probably take forty five hundred American for this thing. This is cool. We need a Canadian. Do they love American money? Yeah. Could we get this for five grand American? We can give him crypto. <laughs> and sans borders, dude. <laughs> Could bring them crypto and legal weed. Yeah, no, they have legal weed. Oh, yeah, he Fuck. won't be swayed. But the crypto he'll like. The crypto, the crypto he'll like. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Throwing, throwing a kilo of maple. Tell him. <laughs> <laughs> I wish this was on Facebook so I could send him an <laughs> offer and. <smile. laughs> Uh, 2010 Challenger SRT10 swapped. This okay, guy's so out his f***ing gourd. Get the f*** out of here. What? Right, right. You can buy a real <laughs> one for yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. No reserve. Modified 1985 Toyota MR2 AW11. Current bid $3,800. Ends in four days. What is this, like a rally spec model? Is, got- it, is it street legal? 202,000 miles on this bring a trailer oh. AW11. Um, This looks Dude. like it's street legal, right? Depends if you're in California or not, basically. Oh, look! It has a three. It has a a three VZFE. Yeah. Sourced from a 1993 Toyota Camry. So what's this make? Like 170 horsepower. I was gonna say. 
This thing I mean, lies though. Still Let's enough to see die. This thing yeah. Yeah. We know what they say. Slow wow. Cars, slow cars look fast. Or fast cars look slow or something like that. S slow cars <laughs> also look slow. This is yeah. <laughs> almost nothing. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, it's 360. Is this Just like we drive to McDonald's? You gotta rotate it, man. You gotta use the thing at the top. What? It's oh, this is a f***ing 360 cam. Oh, way. yeah. Spin it around, dude. Hell dude, that's yeah. Sick. Oh, this is kind of cool. Hey, guy. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what is that? It's kind of just like a stock dash, but like there's so many flat surfaces for him to just kind of set stuff hey, on. That... Why is he holding his steering wheel to the left, but he's going straight? No, because this thing is completely out of alignment. <laughs> no, he's got to pull the steering wheel off and bolt it back straight. Oh, yeah, it's a quick release. Yeah, it's that was way off. I would have fixed that before I made a video for Bring a Trailer <laughs> yeah. to be real. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's a, yeah it is. It's an NRG steering wheel and probably an NRG quick release also. It Do you is. think it makes the ding noise that apparently is all the rage? I like the nipple shift knob. Probably. <laughs> it's probably loud as f in there. There's no I was carpet. about to say, like, this must be awful for a daily driver. Yeah. yeah no, no this carpet, is, there's nothing in there. This is completely purpose-built. It's a tin which, can I get. noise. But, I mean, looking at how nice the body is and how nice the interior is... If he would have just not touched it, he would have had a winner. It looked like it's just built for racing purposes. Yeah, I mean... I mean, what well, we saw at racing, so... Yeah, yeah it's, sure. a, it's a race build. That's fine. Yeah. No, it's not. It's fine for racing, not for daily driving. I'm not offended by this. I think it's cool. But what do we think it's going to go for? Uh, what's it at now? It's at 35 right now. 3,800 with four days left. Has 202,000 miles. Has some obscurish See, kind of V6 out of an old ass Camry in it. 6,800. Right. Yeah, I think yeah, that's a pretty safe bet. That. Right. Uh, well, and the point I was going to make is the buyer pool for this is pretty small because you yeah. got to find somebody that's got money for track time. Also, it's kind of reliable. I mean, come on, it's a V6 out of a Camry. Eh, eh. Imagine cool. doing it's the really spark plugs cool. in this thing. Let me find a better picture of it. Does it have a fire? Uh, no, yeah, spark plug no, easy. Look. Oh there, yeah, there, you just unbolt the other, the, uh, the other bank right there. Right. Yeah, yeah, you're right. The yeah, it's not that bad. Does it have a fuel cell in the front? Um, for proper racing. No, it probably has a normal fuel tank. Yeah, but it just has a normal fuel tank in it. Oh, he's got description and picks on Bring a Trailer. <laughs> this is a budget ass. Uh, if, you, if you're dude. looking for a track toy that's like decently built, this is probably fun for yeah. You know, five, Again, right. like, so now you're looking for somebody that's got like extra money to go racing yeah. with, and like Bring a Trailer is probably the right place for this that. Would be at the same time, this is built completely out of cheap crap, though. We have to note it's like NRG steering wheel, NRG X quick release, XXR. probably fake brides. Yeah, XXR wheels. That's uh, a name I haven't heard in a long time. Yeah, no kidding. At least he bought Toyos. These aren't like, you know, Laufings or something. But I think, like, it's hard to say because the current climate, I think this is 8500 bucks. I wouldn't be surprised. But see, I, the, he 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 really painted himself into a corner by having it be a race car. Yeah, yeah. I mean, right. It, it all goes back to you've got to find somebody who's willing to like go racing with it. But you're at the perfect time for that, though. Like, autocross season is just starting. You yeah, know? I mean, now's the time to dump it if you're going to dump it. Really, it's the time to dump anything. And but but this thing where where it would excel, it's not going to be in that class. The class the the autocross class thing is in is, it's it's probably gonna be shit on. Go back one picture. Yeah. Okay, right there. Look at the at the at the, at the brids. They're yeah. fake because it has it has where it's stamped on, on the the hole where the seatbelt goes in. You see yeah. it's flat. Yeah. That's a, that means it's a fake. Where it says brid, 
Man, you think that they would fix this stuff after so long? Like for their for their China <laughs> and, rides. And that's a, that's that's what sucks about oh, this is how you tell a fake. If I'm the fucking fake dude, I'm like, oh, that's how they're telling it's fake. Let me fix this. Oh. Right. <laughs> but China doesn't give a shit, apparently. They just keep making them look exactly the same for 20 years. I don't get it. But yeah, it's this is all cheap crap, for sure. Um, and yeah, nice. like you said, he's he's probably classed himself out of being competitive because of, like, the cage. Front, is that a, what is that's, that a, that's a battery box. box. Battery. It's, like, it's like a Walmart marine battery box. Yeah. Yep. This thing's probably fun as shit on an SCCA track day. 100%. Not saying it's not, just saying... Yeah, yeah, exactly. Not saying it's not either, but... It, he would have been... It, he would have done a lot better making it a street car. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope there I was know. good reason like to do all this. Still. But yeah, I'm gonna, like say, um, I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say $8,000. Yeah, alright, but alright, so hear me out, though. You could maybe pick this up for... If you scooped this for five, maybe six, and then dumped it and making this a streetcar again, I think that would be sick. That's yeah. a lot of work. That's a ton of work. And also, it's we like gotta, a race grade. It yeah. is not heavier than an MR2 Spider. You gotta MR2. remove the roll cage? Yeah, it does. I think the MR2 Spider is actually the lightest one. Hold on, Damn. That's it's, surprising. I, yeah, we're done looking at this, yeah. right? Twenty two sixteen, yeah, the spider is twenty one ninety five. Damn. Dang. It uses space age aluminum. <laughs> space age. Yeah. So that's also something to consider. Yeah, really honestly, the the ZZW thirty is the best one. And I'm not saying that because that's what I have now. I'm saying that it, because it's true. I, I just I just wish they weren't convertible. I like it, dude. It's fun. I mean I know I was, that it's it's, I was it's converted, fruity, but yeah. It's it's too much fun. Like I thought I'd hate it by now, but it's just great. Yeah, I bet it's fun to drive. Yeah. But moving on. Uh we have a two thousand five Subaru Baja Sport. This is not a turbo. It had fifty six thousand miles, two owners, no modifications, and it sold for seventeen thousand three hundred fifty dollars. If you I, listen if you I, listen, you can hear neck gear dizz in his pants right now. I I'm looking big brain as fuck right now, dude. How many miles and, you got again? And I feel I feel a lot better about going on cars and bids now. How much do you think you have into the Baja at this point? About seventeen three fifty. No, I think I have. When it's all said and done, I'm gonna have probably eleven, maybe twelve thousand in it. Not a bad way to spend ten thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you know, I think I think I guess about eleven thousand. I kind of I kind of bought some some. Um, uh, like JDM shit for it. Like I bought a I bought a JDM uh, um, flat hazard hazard light button. It's red instead of like lame <sighs> lame black, and it just looks cooler. It's gonna make it pop, and I'm I'm feeling good now, dude. This this okay. Yeah, this this, this different it, soundboard is not as easy to use as the other one. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, it, I mean, I'm, I'm, my car, it has 169,000 miles. However, it's going to have a brand new short block, mm -hmm. rebuilt heads, new valve guides. Everything is fucking going to be, I, mechanically, it's going to be nearly new. I Whatever like you do, you're going to have to put it on dug and bids, man. Yeah, yeah. Get, get better pictures than this one. And it'll sell. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm going, I'm going to go fucking ham on the pictures let me all tell these you. all these most of the cars and bids listings are these fucking, like cell phone looking wide ass yeah lens, uh, no, uh, no, no, no. Lenses, they look, all, all the cars look long you know what i mean i'm, I'm right. gonna get i'm gonna get the photographer that did that did the h gen pictures oh there you go he knows what he's doing yeah, yeah and 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 here's some it. nice distant shots it'll look sick yeah, and I'm gonna we're gonna go camping, you know, and I'm gonna get pictures of the Baja with the campfire, you know, because that's Hell yeah. because that's what talking, sells, on, talking what, on that emotion. Yeah, <laughs> what sells what sells a car is is emotion, you know. It's 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 uh like you're gonna recreate the Baja ad. It's the feeling, group. you know. It, it <laughs> you you gotta you gotta sell you gotta sell people the idea. You gotta you gotta sell them the lifestyle. 
Is yours an automatic? H Gen thoughts. Yeah, that you mine's, had. mine's an automatic. So is this one. So, how many miles are on yours? One hundred sixty-nine thousand. Okay. What this one has, at Triple. least. But it's turbo. But mine's turbo, turbo and, and it has a brand yeah. new short block. Yeah, yeah. you could sell and it. Every, and every and I clicked every, on this dude that's go, selling go. it. He's a he's a collector. You could sell it to this dude. He's just gonna flip it on bet. And and every single MFN vacuum hose, coolant hose, every single piece of rubber hose in on in that engine bay is is gonna be replaced by me. And documented and I, on video. And documented on video, color. and I think that's gonna be a big selling point. I yeah. think that I think that if you're going to sell it at an auction, I think that honestly the videos are probably what's going to help. Yeah. Yeah. And 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 the other the other major thing I want is I'm hoping that that as 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 fucking as it sounds that my passion you know is translated into the videos that I'm not just some freaking fly by night scammer dude that I'm I'm yeah. really trying to make a really nice car and do the best I can for right. the next person. I think it'll work. These are I neat. hope. Yeah, I mean, what do you got to lose at this point? Love and grand. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I figure back. at the very least I'll break even. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, seventeen grand for this one. So I mean, it can be done even on dugs and bids. Have and you look, ever looked at what mine, these go for on cars and bids? Or excuse look me, at the, on bring a trailer. The eighteen grand was the last one, non-turbo. Okay. We looked at bring a trailer for yeah. And last, if you if you look at the what I'm going to do on mine is on the on the the roof rails where the roof rails are clamping. Uh huh. I'm painting all that. Okay. Go keep going. Uh, go again. Go again. Because there's a sticker, there's a sticker on the side, and I think there's a close video, close pick of it here. Uh, I'll go back. Oh, back. Okay, yes. you see that sticker? Yeah. Yeah. I have, I have, I, I have a new one, <laughs> and when I paint it, I'm gonna put of the new sticker. Of course, he has a new one. Nice. That looked good. Like, I, yeah, I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm, f I'm elbow deep in. Details right now, man, and it, it sucks because I'm like, <laughs> I'm spending a lot of freaking money. Have you uploaded a new video set for me to edit? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I uh, I cleaned I cleaned the carpet because I wanted to get the carpet clean before I put the seats back in because I wanted to put the seats back in before I turned the engine on. Mm -hmm. And right now, I kind of got I ca I got screwed on a on a rebuilt power steering pump from from Rock Auto because oh yeah power steering pumps. Power steam pumps for that thing are really hard to find, and the one from Rock Auto just was completely wrong, and I and I had to send it back. So I ordered a rebuild kit. Pray to God that rebuild kit has what I need because it works. It's just leaking. So once I get once I get the power steam pump rebuilt, I can I can put the the whole motor back together. I I got the bottom end, not the exhaust manifold and up pipe in, mm -hmm. but I kind of just have the up pipe just sitting there because I need new. I almost I almost put it together with uh, reusing the old up pipe gaskets, but I was like, no, no, that wouldn't be right, you know. And I'm I'm here. It, it's the easiest time to get the new freaking gaskets, so I ordered those also. Honestly, and, I think that your move is to list it on eBay as a classified ad with a buy it now button, and then just do your I know what I have several paragraphs of explanation and links to videos. No, no, because if I'm confident, I. I had to take that confidence to the to the auction block, man. And I think I think I can do it. Right. I think I can get at least fifteen for my car. I wanna see Doug's take. Yeah, I do too. <laughs> yeah, Doug's take is gonna be like, damn, this motherfucker built this whole damn car from the ground up over. He's gonna throw us a fucking shout out for the YouTube channel, dude. Yeah. Oh, like... Yeah, and, and as much as much as I wanna keep that freaking Baja, because it's gonna be brand new. I know it'll be good for the feed, and it'll get us on the map. You know, even even if it's just a little bit. Okay, that's pretty based. I'm gonna stop making fun of you for what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Christ, I went pee, and we're still talking about this. Oh, yep. now we're moving on. Yeah, so um, Baja. I'm so hyped. Like... I'm hyped about the Baja, dude. Yeah, it's gonna be so good when I'm done. Gonna be sick. Uh, moving on, we have a neon SRT4 in. Saskatoon for seventy five hundred Canadian. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't f that with your dick. <laughs> I like these. 
I I don't know, man. I, I don't think that any of them are worth buying anymore. Cars built yeah. making around 450 wheel horsepower will need a few things to drive perfect. Mm, only stock. That's the only way I'd get it. 186,000 kilometers. Yeah, that, me too. I mean, I would buy one of these if it was stock, but those people know what they have and also they don't exist. Right. Did so they're know, not, yeah. Did you know the front windows are electric and the back windows are crank? Yeah. Yeah, nobody Sick. sits in the back. Who cares? <laughs> you don't weight sit reduction, in the back. dude. I think this was also like one of the first cars to have like a no um, no resonator exhaust, so it like backfired really loud, right? Like this um, kind of this kind of started all yeah, of that. I don't know. Yeah. Um, let me hold on. I know these are, like the SRT fours are cool, man. Like don't don't get me wrong, but feeds right. Like the guys that have the stock ones, they aren't selling them because they know how cool they are. Yeah. Yeah, because any modified car, you know, you're you know you're getting someone else's problem. Yeah. This is what these sound like stock. Sick. What do you mean? Yeah. This dude has like a 70 Super B next to it. <clears throat> like, you hear all that backfiring? Yeah. yeah. That's what these sounded like off of the dealer lot. Oh my god. god. <laughs> wow. Alright, this one's got some issues, or it's really cold. Nah, that's black smoke. This is. That boy, yeah, that boy's been sick. Oh, hell yeah. Da na 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 na. That's pretty it? sick. Yeah. How about a 2ZZ MR2 Spider convertible? 60,000 original miles, 2ZZ swapped, um, dumb paint job. That's a good price. Something wrong with it? Yeah. It's, but is uh, that is that is that 60,000 on the 2ZZ or Yeah, yes it is. 92,000 yeah, on the body plastic. though. So I mean, come on. That's not that still bad. Still not bad. Still not bad. Not bad. Yeah. It is uh, remanufactured. Um this this is a salvage title. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I mean, if you don't want to, if you don't want to sell it ever and just own it for yourself, then like, sure. Yeah, I, I mean, think every it's... but like, look though, like everyone that like has a salvage title always says, "Oh yeah, it was a huge crash and it shouldn't have totaled the car out, but it did." Well, yeah, right. That's what a salvage title exists for, man. <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, I think it's a good deal if you, like you said, like if it's just something that you want to keep forever, this would be a pretty sweet deal. Like you don't have to tell people it's a salvage mm -hmm. title if it drives right. right. Who cares? But yeah, I, I don't think the, you could flip this just, for much I, more. I don't I find hate, those. I find those reverse eyelids interesting. Yeah, I don't hate that at all. It's got like the inside edges painted also, and then it's got yeah, like a it's like warrior it or something. It, it like kind of brings it up another five to ten years in design. It's like it can't believe the shit it just saw in front of it. <laughs> it's just disgusted. I kind of like the stripe on the side too, like how he's yeah, got it going up into right. the yeah. end of the. This person's got pretty decent taste. Yeah. So when I don't you hate put this a white, at all. when you put a white stripe on yours, like that? <laughs> no, nah, not a chance. <laughs> but yeah, go to the back uh, of this car. Ken Lee said it's got it's got budget. Yeah, it's got nine eleven font in the back. Yeah, it's got some goofy ass spider is badge that a on the back. Porsche spider badge? Probably, yeah, I think it yeah. is. Yeah. Alright, yeah, I'm, the... I'm gonna pee and get a drink. I'll be right back. Alright. Yeah, the MR2 spider badge is like really tiny and it's over to the right. Like there's three different fonts on the back of a stock MR2. Dude, that is the fing Porsche spider badge. Of yeah. course. Put it in the Google. Yeah, and I mean like you can tell, like the side stripes are also like Porsche inspired. Yeah. 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 Person really wanted a Porsche. Yeah. Yeah, like he's trying to sell it. To, ask him if he's gonna sell it to buy a Boxster or something. Don't go trade him a Boxster. Trying to buy a Boxster or <laughs> are we bad people? We're not bad people. I'm not doing anything wrong. It's all just good. Ask, just asking questions. Yeah, I'm like Alex Jones. <laughs> <laughs> is that who you like? <laughs> His hero, Alex Jones. Alex Jones rules, dude. So what's your stance on frogs? 
It's way too much. Way too many lady <laughs> stuff in my <laughs> recommends on here. It is pretty close by. Let's see how beat this thing is. Fox body Mustang GT pulled up on my FRS the other day. Mm hmm. It sounded it makes, so sick just sitting there, just like growling. about the same power if it's stuck. But it sounded a thousand <laughs> times cooler. Yeah. The just from sitting there idling at the stoplight. Uh, probably had like some loping cam or something. Whatever it was, it sounded great. Look at the it, underside of this car. Fucked. <laughs> this is pretty rough. It has mismatched wheels also. Oh, dude, ACR is this seat. an ACR? No. Just the ACR seats. It's got a bunch of problems. He's got a list. Car has what I call quite a bit of rust. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this you is oof. Say. Ew. Bro. Oof. List of like parts. Hey, but get transmission. Moving on. Yeah, this thing sucks. Who? Um, we have, uh, an ad for Wayfair. We have a 2003 Mercury Marauder, $11,000 listed in Alberta. God, ma Marauders Next. are not worth this much money. They are. They are. They're all Too going bad. for this price. That one's <sighs> even missing a lug nut. Ugh. You keep saying that. You said that about the other one that we looked at, too. This might oh, be the same no, car. Oh, no, it's the covers. It's the, it's the covers. This one's rusty because it's in Canada. That one's a piece of <laughs> shit. 103,000 miles. Next. Yeah. Next. What's behind it? Town something car. cooler. What is that? Like a uh, Triumph or something? I don't know. Like behind it or like behind like behind the car? Or just this is the only picture of it. Behind it behind is like a Cadillac uh, Eldorado. Yeah. No, I think that's a Thunderbird. See the round taillights? Hmm. Yeah, that might be Thunderbird. Yeah, and there's like a Buick or something on the other side. No, I think it's a, it's I think it's an Eldorado. No, I think that's right. It's a Cadillac. Which yeah. one? Behind the it. Oh. Like like a like a two thousand Eldorado. Mm -hmm. Next. Yeah. yeah, next. Mazda Marauders B series Saskatoon <laughs> B twenty two hundred. It's bagged. It has spoked hub rims, three hundred eleven thousand miles on the original motor. <laughs> Fantastic yeah. little truck. Just trying to uh, trade for a dirt bike, and I'm not reading this correctly, <laughs> but he wants a dirt bike, and he needs to oh, sell this damn. dumped B twenty two hundred. This is El Paso spec, if I ever saw it. Yeah. yeah, I was gonna say, what's that doing in Canada? There aren't any Mexicans in Canada. <laughs> El Paso spec. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is three hundred eleven thousand. Oh, it's kilometers. Excuse God. me, but still, like quarter million miles, right? No, it's one hundred hundred eighty thousand ish. Oh, okay. Canada still too. though, that's a lot of fucking <laughs> miles. It has like a five gallon fuel cell on it. This is silly. Yeah. No. Yeah. I'm, don't buy this, Brock. Next. Honda S2000, uh, it's a club racer with AC and audio, $56,000. Right. Fair deal. <laughs> How many miles? 75. 75,000 miles. Yeah, you can keep that. I'll, I'll take that one for 22.5 all day. Would you rather have a club racer S2000 not for, or an not for FDR double, Not for X7? double the price. I'd rather buy that one S2000 and buy a brand new Corolla hatchback. <laughs> 100%. Original owner. It's cool, but it's not $56,000 cool. You're out your not, yeah. mind. No. Not for me. No. Nah. Fair deal. Above market by $3,000? These club racers are going for fifty grand plus. I don't believe that. They just... They're not that cool. Nope. Yeah, I I would take I take a I Lotus Exige over that all day. If yeah, I'm you thinking, could buy yeah, a Lotus Exige for that money I was too. Say, yeah, you could buy one cheaper. Yeah, you could buy an Avora for fifty six thousand mm -hmm. dollars. Okay, Lotus Avora or that ninety four FD that we looked at earlier. Avora, Avora, oh, Avora. Yeah. yeah. If it, yeah, me personally because I want I want the back seat. You know, I want I want to bring the kid along. You could put the JDM back seat in the FD. 
Does it? Yeah, I saw a certain bald man who loves Zing do it once. <laughs> That's going to do it for this episode of Collective Car Feed Podcast. Thanks to our sponsors, HGenuine. That's h-genuine.com. Use offer code FEED at checkout for a special offer. And Outworld Systems. For all your refurbished electronic needs, outworldsystems.com. Links are in the description. Thanks for listening, and we'll see you in the next one.